House of Representatives has started taking delivery of the Toyota Camry 2020 model cars acquired for members as official cars, otherwise called utility vehicles, the punch has reliably learned. A correspondent cited some of the cars at different parking lots within the National Assembly complex on Thursday. The legislators had at an executive closed door session on February 5, 2020, resolved to purchase 400 units of the exotic car. The House, of, the House has, however, kept seed lips on the cost of each unit as the contract for the supply it was lands was not awarded to accredited Toyota dealers. Our correspondent observed that the House procured the V6 limited edition variant of the car. Chairman of the Committee on House Services, Mr. Wale Raji, who confirmed delivery of the cars, declined to respond to further inquiries. The cars, which belong to the National Assembly, are usually auctioned to the lawmakers after four years. A check on the website of Toyota revealed that each of the vehicles, depending on the variant, has a price tag of between $25,000 US dollar to $35,000 US dollar excluding the cost of shipping and custom duties, which is about 100% of the actual cost of each unit. For instance, those with higher specification, which most often than not is their preferred choice of lawmakers, could cost taxpayers a tidy sum. Vehicles in this range are XLE at $29,455, XLE VIXIS at $34,580, XSE at $30,000, and XSE V6 at $35,130. Already about 14 Toyota Land Cruiser Prado Sport Utility Vehicles have already been handed out to presiding as well as other principal officers and chairman of select house committees. Some lawmakers who were contacted for Thursday on Thursday said they had not yet to receive vehicles delivered in the first batch. Given a breakdown of how vehicles are shared, a member of the House who spoke on the condition of anonymity for fear of retribution said the 400 saloon cars would be allocated to each of the 360 members and some top management staff, chiefs of staff, to the two presiding officers as well as some of their special advisors and assistants. The lawmaker explained that new members who did not get committee appointment would benefit from the first badge. The source said, I was told 100 have already arrived and they are sharing them to new members who are not chairman and deputy chairman of committees. The next batch will be for returning ranking members who are neither chairman or deputy chairman the last batch will go to ranking member with appointment the committee on house services and the national assembly management led by the clerk of the national assembly mohammed sani omoluri had constituted a joint committee to oversee the acquisition verification and distribution to the lawmakers the committee on house services which also exists in the senate serves as a protocol and welfare department. The joint committee was set up as some members had alleged that the National Assembly had become a dumping ground for smuggled and refurbished automobiles. Hmm. So guys, uh, you can see that uh, these people are really adamant. And once they say they want to get something, they will get it and nothing will happen. Nothing will happen. Like uh, this issue of uh, uh, what the disease that is in town, people have been talking, a lot of individuals have been making contributions on how they are going to help people. In as much the government is saying, you have to do this commanding, to own commanding, you have to do this, you have to stay at home and what have you, good, f good and fine. But then what follows at the end of the day, because they will tell you what happens in Sena environment. The other day, she uh, Bola Tinumbu was talking about, oh, he heard from uh, Boris Johnson, was saying this, that he was glad that such a thing can really be done in our country as well or in our society but they will not tell you the good things that those people are doing to their masses no they will not go there but when it comes to they want to enforce a, 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 a kind of restriction or law they want to just get at the masses they will be 
talking of what is happening in a sinner environment but the goodness and the goodies that is attached that the uh, in a sinner environment that people enjoy they will not talk about it what is just on the air now oh everybody must stay at home but what happens they are not singing the the the, the welfare package they have already uh, they are supposed to give to the people which is called a stimulus we are not hearing anything about it and meanwhile Atiku has already called the National Assembly. He has said, oh, this is what I'm going to do, uh, uh, donate. Well, he has already told them that he has called the National Assembly to be able to do something, to be able to come out with package, to be able to come out with, you know, something that will back it up so that it will be to be done, you know, as a federal government. No, they are not saying anything. They are pussyfooted. They will not do anything. But now they've started getting the delivery of this, the, the, the 2020 model. You can see the, the, the make of those cars and they will get it. And these are the people we talk about. People will tell you, oh, Nigeria is not a structured place. How can you be comparing Nigeria with, uh, with uh, other countries that are developed, that are structured? You can see what your, 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 your leaders are taking. And they are richer, you know, from all indications, it's in the public domain. They are richer than these so-called developed countries. At this point in time, these people, what is paramount to them is to be sharing whatever they want to share at this point in time. There is no, they don't, they don't have a, they don't conscience. I think that's just the way. And they are insensitive to what is happening now. The people that they represent, the House of Representatives that's supposed to, that's supposed to, they are, they are for the people that really speak for the people. They are not doing anything. Femi Gwajabi Amila, the last time he went to go and celebrate his birthday, some people, uh, his mother's birthday, they will tell you, oh, what is your business about it? He has the money and all of that. The, pro the question I always ask, before they join politics in the first place, go and check their background. If they are as rich as, you know, if they were rich as what is obtainable now. No. But people who are still suffering, that is the, the most painful aspect of this whole thing. The Nigerians that are still suffering, they are the ones that will be making excuses for them. See what is happening. They will tell you, oh, it is not possible. Yes, they will tell you, oh, things cannot just work. How do you expect the government to do this? Some people are even expecting the government to feed them. You can imagine some kind of statement coming out from people. Tell me where these people got this money from. Is this their pocket money? Is it their personal money that they are using to buy? We are not even talking of uh, this. Thing. You can imagine what they are saying that uh, uh, the Joint Committee was set up as some members had alleged that the National Assembly had become a dumping ground for small good and refurbished automobiles. And people have been saying, if you really want to do this, if you are really patriotic, just get a coastal bus. If there's anywhere you want to go, pack yourself together and go there. No, they will tell you, no, 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 they can't do that. It is they're, they're, the arrogance. It is the same arrogance that has led us to this place, to, to where we are now. See, the, the chief of staff that was supposed to have gone on self-isolation it didn't go it was just sharing but it's good that he's sharing all of those things to themselves and now some of them are saying oh please pray for us please pray for us those who have been affected who are who have tested positive oh please pray for us please pray for us and when nigerians are you know reacting they'll say oh why would you be rejoicing over the misfortune of other people but see what has been happening see what people have been going through now, because of this, uh, this new disease in town, that's why we have not been hearing all this uh, smear doing all manner of things. The president has never even spoken anything concerning it. He's not even bothered. And people will be making excuses. Like uh, Khan, uh, uh, Khan president said, this uh, issue of uh, 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 smear issue is even worse than coronavirus that we are talking about. But they never said anything. But because they know that this is going to affect them, this uh, issue of uh, disease is going to affect them. That's why we are just hearing them talking, you know, they're not even talking, even they're not because of the masses. They are not even talking because of the masses. Can you see how insensitive these people are? Do you know how much is it has cost you and I? The sweat, you know, it has cost us out of our sweat that these people are buying this kind of a this kind of a, 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 a cars with this amount 400. They are going to be sharing it for themselves. And at the end of the day, if you know, if somebody is doing something that is commendable, that is really you know that can be uh, uh, equipped to the good governance or to good things they are doing it would have been okay but just check what they receive what they get the benefits and all of that compared to the work they do to the work on ground you cannot just merge it up you cannot just merge it up so it's unfortunate it's unfortunate that this time they are sharing this you know we were talking about this even before you know you think that okay maybe they will have a, a change of mind they that once they come out they tell you they want to buy something they want to do this and that they had already sealed it up. So whatever anybody is saying is inconsequential. See, they've started getting the delivery of those cars. And this thing has been on since 1999. It date 20 years down the line. 
20 years down the line, that is what they have been doing. And they will tell you, oh, they, 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 they need to be a change. They need to be a change. They talked about a other, a, 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 a other regime that have come, that they said they squander this, they squander that. And yet, now, the same thing. And that's why we always say, this, whether PDP or APC or whatever, they are the same. The foundation of this country is faulty. That is just the way it is. It's just faulty. You can imagine... The word, what they are talking about that uh, in the past that a uh, national assembly had become a dumping ground then what is the face of the masses right from time the people are living in penury they are living in abject poverty nobody's talking anything about all of those things it's unfortunate someone says you people are in the house of for pleasure and luxury and not for the pain of mass masses imagine one car will cost over 10 million naira why pensioners are dying no facilities in the public school and hospital. No facility. No light. Good roads. Nigeria is done. No light. No hospitals. That is what somebody is saying. And which is true. Mm. They are sharing latest Camry. But common 10k is hard for them to give common Nigeria. God of mercy. What is 10,000 naira? If they give uh, every Nigeria 100,000 naira or 50, 50,000 naira. Is 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 it too much? It's not too much. It's not too much. You know, with what we are passing through, let us see how they are going to be enforcing this law. Oh, stay at home, stay at home. But any little thing. Oh, I love what Joris Bonsi is saying. Oh, so I support total lockdown. Oh, uh, in a sinner environment. Now they will not do the same thing. But the wickedness they will be perpetrating the wickedness is unfortunate. So guys, let us hear your opinion concerning this. Uh, let us say uh, from the. House of Representatives, they are sharing car 2020 model. Can you imagine? Full option, full option.